Seems like whenever I've done a video on creating links within Evernote, I've received comments from people asking when Evernote will roll out backlinks. Well, apparently the folks at Evernote have heard you. They have in fact introduced or are introducing backlinks. Now you can follow threads in either direction. Hi, I'm Dave Edwards, and today a very quick look at the introduction of this new feature. I'm actually going to be making more videos in the future on how you can use backlinks as part of your productivity system, but because this feature is just being rolled out, I thought I'd share the news so that you can play around with backlinks. Uh, this feature, by the way, will be available for personal, professional, and team subscribers to Evernote. It is part of their version 10.51.7 for Mac and Windows, and version 10.46 on iOS uh, and on Android. Now, I use a lot of links, so this is really going to be important to me. For example, I just created a note called vacation, well, I created a notebook uh, to plan my next vacation. And I've titled the notebook as to the destination of where I'm going to go and the date of where I'm going to go. Now, within that notebook, I am putting my hotel reservation, my airline reservation, the rental car information, those will be all separate notes. On the itinerary, I wanna make sure that I have links to all of those individual notes so I can just follow along. So now you have note A linked in note B. <laughs> From note A, we're now going to see a list of all the notes that have linked the original note. And you can click on any of those in the back links menu. By the way, I'm using images provided by Evernote because quite frankly, the new version has not rolled out to my computer yet. So let's say you insert a note link into a note related to what you're working on. Again, my vacation itinerary. So then I'll have a link to the flight reservation and another to the hotel reservation. Those notes will show a backlink option. See the arrow note there? They're gonna show that little backlink option. And those are related to the original note. So this will be very helpful if you're creating, for example, a table of contents. I think we're also going to find it very useful for whatever we're doing research, uh, projects. Uh, if you're a student, probably class notes, medical records. I think there's going to be a ton of use for links and backlinks. One caution from Evernote is that for security reasons, you can only access backlinks to those notes that you have permission to access. So if you're sharing a notebook, you won't have access to all of the notes unless the creator has given you permission. As I said, Evernote just started rolling out backlinks in version 10.51.7 for Mac and Windows and version 10.46 for iOS and Android. So you're probably going to see it very soon. Check, it may have already rolled out into your system. Now, once I've had a chance to play with this feature, I'll be sharing uh, some experiences on how you can make backlinks work as part of your productivity system. So please subscribe and you won't miss any of my videos. Thanks a lot.